yo, yo, you're watching the internet's most passionate family that raised on me. And in this video, we make it home. Enjoy. So we got a little continental breakfast here. Sarah's uploading the video because our internet at the hotel wasn't as good last night. So she's trying to make sure that she uploads two days ago, the vlog from two days ago, so we're a day behind. We're going to get both up today for sure. Um, so by the time you see this, hopefully they're both up. Yeah, they should be both up. Here with Belly in some hot chocolate. Is it good, baby? And then Sadie's getting up on some bagel. Where are we going right now? To the swimming pool. We might, because we actually have to go back to, let's see what mommy wants to do, okay? If not, we're just trying to get back to Seattle as fast as possible. So I can see my baby Brittany. Oh, God. Her American girl. Her you were crying for her last night because you were missing her, huh? She gets really emotional at night. And last night she didn't. It's okay. <laughs> and I got emotional the first night. Because <laughs> Bixby? Yeah. You're fine, though. She didn't come. Yeah. All right, let's, let's, get, let's finish. Awesome. Let's finish so we can go back to, um, to the room with Mommy, okay? I'm going to go to the swimming pool. Is gonna come and show us how we do it. So, if you're at a hotel <laughs> and you make a little bed with blue um, thing or like any color, yep, you just get the pillows. It has to be uh, a couch bed. This is a couch bed. Bella's gonna test it out for us. Here we go. Let's see how they look. She climbs up there. Climbs. Sit right there. Slides. <laughs> okay, it's my turn. We're testing out my arrow. It's like it's like a slide. It's like a water slide. <laughs> it's my turn. Let's uh, fix Let's it do up. it together this time. We just put our feet like that. Just our feet, and then. Hold on, I have to jump off. Jump, wing. Let me try that. Two, three. <laughs> at the same time. I'll tell you when to go. Feet like that. Let's see. Oh, we gotta hurry though. Go. Woo! <laughs> that was fun. Did you see the bathroom? I did it nice and smooth. Yeah, you did. <laughs> yeah. Hello, we just checked out of our hotel and we're headed back to Seattle from Eugene. It's about a five hour drive, right? Five. And we're kind of left in a crazy rush, as always. We're always just like relaxing till the last minute. <laughs> and then we're like, oh my god, we gotta check out. So my hair is kind of crazy. But it looks super crazy out here. It's like a Twilight movie, huh, babe? Yeah, it is. <laughs> what up, y'all? Team, Team Edward or Team Jacob? Is that the guy's Jacob? Mm -hmm. Team Edward below. Hashtag Team Edward. Or Team Jacob. I think one time I said Colin and Bella, but his name is Edward Colin. I really messed up. <laughs> yeah, she messed up. Um, but yeah, so Team Edward. So did you know that uh, the town called Forks from the movie uh, is actually like a couple hours from us? It's in the Washington, Western Washington area by an ocean. We should go. We should go sometime. Should we go? Like the video, thumbs up. And we'll take you there sometime if you're a fan. That was such a big movie. Um, I prefer the Hunger books, Games. The books are huge too. Yeah, I prefer Hunger Games, but I know a lot of, a lot of girls loved the Twilight series. So headed back, excited. We're probably gonna have a quick lunch and then do dinner in Seattle. It's about one o'clock now. We'll be back at about. If we do dinner here or lunch here, probably about six. So. Perfect time to work on a little homework and reading with Sadie, and then uh, get ready for... Get groceries and all that yeah. stuff, get ready for the week. I'm ready to cook, I'm ready to have green juice, I'm ready to like cleanse from the goodness yes. we've been having. It's good, but I don't feel very good. Do you want to call your bride Glitter Bride? My, my tiny bride? No. No, Glitter Bride. Who is Glitter Bride? 
Bye, 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 no, yeah, you. She wants little Bella. Little Tell her you want her her to be called that. Little bride. But you want her to be. Yeah, I want to be called Little Bride. Okay. That was such a good idea, Belle. You have to remind me when we make the program, okay? So I'm going to take your bride and groom. Okay. Bella has been saying forever that she's my sister's wedding planner, okay. so she's I having see. ideas right now. Yeah. My sister's registering. <laughs> Yo, so we're here uh, at uh, in Salem, eating some pizza before we head back to Seattle. Last stop. Um, wait, 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 wait. Put it down. No, no, no. Put it down. Put it down. So um, we're all taking selfies over here. But so we just posted that tonight. You guys uh, last night. Oh, by the time you watch this, we're posting two vlogs at once. Um, probably within like 20 minutes of each other or something like that. But mommy and mommy and Sadie are doing some selfies and we've been eating some salad. Let me see. Wow. Because who else is doing selfies on that side of the table? Yeah. <laughs> You're so cute, Bella. We made it home, the girls finished up, or Sadie finished up her homework, and Bella just kind of hung out with me while I tried to organize the kitchen, because I'm going to go to the grocery store right now after they get to bed. But, thank made you for it. driving us. Back at it, Sarah's going to go get some food for... Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, I'm like... She I'm... was going to say what I was, because she start, got excited, so yes. go ahead. I'm very motivated right now to cook, because we haven't cooked for a long time, and I want to meal prep for this week. So I'm gonna go to the grocery store and do that. And I'm excited. I think it's because we've been like in the car all day, like sitting. I just wanna be like out and moving, so it's not too late. It's like eight o'clock, so we're gonna be okay and do that. Um, but the girls are gonna get going to bed and we're gonna try to just get some more laundry going. We're on like our second load of laundry already. Cause we wanted to wash all the sheets so they're fresh and then we have like a whole suitcase full of dirty clothes. Cause you know, ten, eight, I think it was like 10 days we were gone, nine. We got a lot of laundry to do. Mommy's gonna go get some groceries. Mommy will. Okay, love you. See you in a bit. All right, girls. Haven't been in this bed for a long time. Can you scoot over a little bit to get closer to uh, Bella to sing the song? That was a good one, y'all. All right, let's pray. All right, I know I look crazy, but it's been a long day. Started out in Oregon and now I'm in Washington, but I think I have everything I need. I got tons of fruit and veggies. A big thing of chicken and a big thing of turkey because I'm gonna make meatballs to like pack in the things. Tupperware, I gotta find all my Tupperware too. Or containers, any containers. But I'm gonna look for like a natural-ish medicine because the girls have been having this little cough. So I'm gonna get that stuff for them here. Oh man, there's so many. Let's look for the kids. Okay, I'm gonna finish up and get home so I can start cooking. Really excited about this week. So excited, so refreshed to be back in the swing of things. I know I got a lot of work going on this week. However, I wanted to give you a Motivation Monday and this one is really exciting for me because when we went to California, like going to there, you know, leaving and heading out to California, we had got the rush of, of, of you know, a few thousand new people to this community via subscribers. I don't like that word, but hey, subscribers, but family members. And uh, our video started to start to get more views. And we went to California. You saw kind of like who we were. You know, I believe that you are the sum of your closest friends and you saw our closest friends over there. So there's a lot of excitement, a lot of mo uh, momentum. And you know, all that to say that going into this week, I'm thinking about, man, I gotta put that swagger on. I gotta hashtag, put it below, put my swagger on. I gotta put my swagger on. And when I say that, think of swagger as this confidence, as this positivity, this humility, this grace, this greatness that sometimes we have the power. I believe we do have the power to flip a switch put that swagger on, puff our chest out, 
and have a better attitude immediately about life. So many times in life, we don't have this swagger on, this confidence, and, and, and when things hit us, you know, it, 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 we're so easily moved by the things that kind of hit us. But when you have this swagger on, you stand still. You're confident in your beliefs, your core values. You're, you're, you're confident that you can get out of any situation. And when we say, you know, with a little bit of you and a little bit of us, we can change. I really mean that because if you put this swagger on, start living this out in your world, and we do the same thing, we literally can make this ripple effect, this like butterfly effect, and start to influence and, and really help our communities, our collective communities. So I really just want you to begin to think about that. Think of swagger as this thing, this coat that you can put on yourself, this, this mantle, this covering that you can put on yourself to make immediate changes in your life. So with that said, put your swagger on. The moment you put that on, look at areas of your life that, that you can make a positive step in the right direction. Hashtag put my swagger on, thumbs up, like it, and always, always remember with a little bit of you and a little bit of us, we are changing the world. Peace. So we made it to my best friend's house. She lives a little out of Sacramento and um, she made a whole full meal Christmas Mexican meal. You're crazy. You are Only so for crazy. you guys to a Merry Christmas dinner. So she made rice, coleslaw, mashed potato, guisao, fresh tortillas, and salsa and charro beans. Oh, hold on, hold on.